make it sound so dramatic. I mean, we're just going around Sonrisa for a bit, right? Maybe. I just don't get to leave the shrine that often, is all. Ah, uh, is that because of the spirit code? No, it's because one of the Oracion Say scolded me for doing so. Huh? Uh, but why? It was a few years ago. One day, I heard a continental monster crying out in pain. I couldn't just leave it to suffer like that, so I made a decision. I decided to leave the shrine to go help it. Selfie to the rescue! I ended up wandering for about three days. The terrain kept changing, and I never actually reached my destination. Eventually, the cry stopped too. The continental monster probably just ended up healing on its own. Well, that's good at least. So, what you're saying is, you just took the world's longest walk. After that, I couldn't find my way home. I wandered like that for about a week. A whole week? Was Sonrisa's barrier okay? A general named Loray had to defend the town the whole time I was gone. She eventually formed an emergency elemental search party, and they brought me back to the shrine. What a mess! She told me to never, ever, ever, ever go outside of the shrine again. She scolded me for hours in utter darkness. That's terrifying. But now I have you, Ted, my darling brother, here to help me. <laughs> you see where I'm going with this, right? You want to go give that Horacio General an earful? Uh, who do you think I am? I'm actually thankful that she brought me back home. Though I could do without the oppressive darkness. I can hear people's voices carried on the wind, and I hear the voices of the suffering. Just tell me which way to go, and we'll go there. Leave it to my darling brother to be so reliable. All right, let's begin our journey of healing. Selfie Squad, away! Over here, Selfie! And, by the way, east doesn't mean right. Oops, silly me. It's left, isn't it? No, it's neither. Yeah, I've never seen someone with such a bad sense of direction before. It's almost impressive. <laughs> Maggie, right? Are you okay? Barely. Let my guard down and a monster bit me. I don't think I'm gonna make it. If only I could have one last taste of my hometown's coffee. Sophie, isn't there anything you can do? It's okay. I can handle this. Looks like we're just in time. Irregular heartbeat, pale skin. Looks like a case of monster poisoning. Don't worry. Just drink this antidote and you'll feel fine. Thank you. <coughs> oh, looks like you couldn't get it down. <laughs> this is the last thing I'd ever taste. I know it might taste bitter, but please try to drink it all. You can do this. Oh, fine. <laughs> Shish. The way this stuff must taste, it almost kind of sounds like you'd rather just... The pain. It's gone. Thank you, miss. You saved me. <laughs> that was the most disgusting thing I've ever tasted in my entire life. But I'm glad it worked. By the way, I have some friends over across the river. They could use your assistance too. I left to go call for help, but... Uh, well... No need to explain. We'll go help them. I can hear their voices. Let's go, my darling brother! <sighs> over here, Sophie! And to answer your question, no. We're not trapped in some magical liminal space. This place again? How can this be? Uh, it's because we're just going around in circles! <laughs> I suppose that's what you get.
forget for letting me lead the way. You're the one who just decided to go running off. Hang on. There's someone lying on the ground. Are you okay? Yes. Uh, I was attacked by a monster. I, I, I managed to fight it off, but my body is numb and I, I can't move. I see. It looks like a curse. A curse? Like arches? Thankfully, it's nothing that serious. It's actually more like what you'd call a status ailment. We can treat it by defeating the monster, or... With your healing powers. Exactly! Something like this should be no problem. <laughs> you sound more excited than usual. Everything will be fine. Just hold still. <sighs> I feel so much better. I think I'll be able to return home now. Your friend is waiting for you over there. You should get back right away. Thank you, fellow from Agia. And thank you as well, miss. Don't mention it. I just love helping people get better. Should we head back to the shrine now? Not yet. I hear another voice. I think it's the Continental Monster. We should go... Oh. That selfie's hitting her limit. Hey, don't push yourself. Wait, this is what I want. To heal people. I've wanted to do this for such a long time. It's because I'm with you that I can go and heal everyone. But aren't you tired from using your healing powers? I think her dedication might be even stronger. We need to go and help these people right now. Tin, my darling brother, please. I got you. Thank you, Tin. I couldn't live with myself if I stopped you from doing what you love. I'm glad you understand. Now then, we need to go that way. All right, follow me. Over here, Sophie. And just an idea, maybe pick something other than an animal to use as a landmark. <laughs> I just thought I might try to use your advice. Landmarks are called landmarks for a reason. <laughs> yep, that makes sense. I hope you guys like circles, because you're not going to believe this. You said you heard the Continental Monster, right? Shouldn't it be around here somewhere? Oh, wait a sec. I can hear it right now. There are some blocked and damaged capillary roots around here, too. There, there. I'll treat you right away. That should do it. Thank you, Tin. I can't believe how many people we helped today. We covered a lot of ground, that's for sure. Our very own fiend of healing really took center stage back there. Zephyr of healing. I'm serious, though. I really appreciate it. Finally. It finally feels like I can go out there and help people. Just don't do it until you drop, okay? <laughs> My darling brother worries too much. Hey, at least you didn't pass out today. All right, let's head back to the shrine. <sighs> Uh-oh, what's the matter? Uh, I'm too tired to move. Hey, you did good today. Want me to carry you? <laughs> I'll gladly take that offer. This isn't just about not collapsing, you know. You're right. I'll learn to push myself and not collapse next time. You know that's not the problem here. <laughs> Sorry for always making you do this. <laughs> Are your healing powers really that draining? Magic is difficult to control, even for us elementals. Imagine how great it would be if you got it under control. It, yes. Well, the thing is... You haven't had a chance to use your powers that much, right? Well, if you keep using them, I'm sure you'll get better eventually. Does that mean you'll take me on more trips? That's what I promised, isn't it? Yay! I'm so excited to go again. Hope you don't mind carrying her home every time. <laughs> Hey, 
रहे हैं 